Since this great recession hit, the number of people requesting mental health services has soared. But even people with jobs are not immune to the pressure. So now a number of Bay Area employers are providing specialized training to help with people cope with their stress. Here's ABC 7's health and science reporter, Carolyn Johnson. Step one being focus your attention in the area around your heart. These employees at Stanford are feeling stressed. I haven't had a, a good night's sleep in four or five years. Every day is a stressful day. You always have um, the feeling that somebody younger, quicker, brighter, cheaper is going to outplace you. It's enough stress that the University Medical School is now offering stress management training, just like an increasing number of companies around the Bay Area. Step two being breathe in a steady rhythm. Imagine you could breathe in and out through the heart. Bruce Cryer is CEO of M-Wave. The company produces the biofeedback device he's using to train employees to adjust their breathing, heart rate, and mental state. The core concept was that stress was pervasive and having a far more damaging effect on individual lives, individual health, and organizational lives and organizational health than we were yet recognizing. We saw a close-up demonstration at the office of San Francisco psychologist Corey Birkin. He used the M-Wave software to guide a patient through a series of steps. The system monitors pulse as the patient visualizes his positive feelings and regulates his breathing. The waves on the left side of the screen represent an optimal heart rate when a person is relaxed. You see, we want your breathing here to look just like the coach, like the pacer. Within a few minutes, the patient's heart rate is roughly in line, what the M-Wave system calls reaching coherence. Later, Dr. Birkin will coach the patient to achieve the same result using a portable version of the device, like this one being used at the Stanford seminar. And so by using this method, he is able to produce a state of what we call coherence. That's that nice, smooth wave where his breathing is even and his heart rate is even. Try to stay practicing as, as you listen to me. The M-Wave combines a variety of techniques used in other therapies in biofeedback systems and has been studied for more than a decade. What's changed, according to Bruce Cryer, is the level of stress that people now believe they're under in this era of layoffs, bankruptcies, and home foreclosures. I think the worst part for a lot of people is just this, this sense of what's going to happen next. Carolyn Johnson reporting. Companies including Hewlett Packard, Boeing, and Cisco have offered similar training. Stanford has scheduled another session for later this month for faculty and campus employees.